Well, we love good news and positive stories, and that's why we bring you our Believe in Buffalo series, highlighting the people and projects that make Western New York an incredible place to live, work, and play. And tonight, my colleague Jeff Russo is on board a food truck in South Buffalo, heating up the local food scene. He's on board that food truck right now. Tell us all about that, Jeff. Well, good evening, Leah. Hello, everyone. Everyone take a deep breath. Can you smell that? Check this out. It is a Nashville hot chicken party here on board the Hen House food truck. The team here has been cranking out spicy fried chicken creations since last spring. And the response, Leah, has been so overwhelming that the team is now opening up a new brick and mortar location in North Buffalo to try and keep up with demand. We are Hen House. I've been wanting to open up a food truck probably since I was like 10 years old. Set up right next to Briar Brothers Brewery in South Buffalo is the red food truck spicing up the local food scene. Gotta have a nice crinkle cut pickle here. Sal Andalina is one of the founders of Hen House. We specialize in Nashville hot chicken, uh, hand breaded chicken tenders, fried chicken sandwiches. Hen House first hit the road in the spring of 2021 when Andalina partnered with some friends to bring the heat and tradition of Nashville hot chicken to Western New York. It's a mixture of the, the hot fryer oil, butter, and then our, our Nashville hot seasoning, which is primarily cayenne pepper, uh, brown sugar, and some other spices. It's awesome. It's very hot. It's, it's a lot hotter. Like our medium is, is not your standard buffalo you know, buffalo chicken wing medium. And it's been a recipe for success with people lining up for the hand breaded, never frozen, incredible fried chicken creations. You know, we couldn't be here without having that hot hen sandwich Sal, Take it away. All right, guys. So we start out with our chicken that we've been having brine overnight, buttermilk and hot sauce. I'm going to toss that in our flour blend. We got 12 different spices and seasonings in here. Then it's into the fryer as Sal gets the rest of the sandwich ready with a toasted brioche roll, a secret hen sauce, homemade slaw, and dill pickles. Grab our tenders out of the fryer. Go for a little swim here. A little dust. Put her all together. All of that on one sandwich? Oh yeah. That's amazing. All right, here you go, the hot hen sandwich. So good. So good, in fact, Hen House is expanding the coop beyond the food truck. Nice. The team now operates kitchen space at Dome Stadium in Tonawanda and are set to open a new brick and mortar space at 690 Hurdle Avenue in late December. It's going to be counter service so you can sit down and order at the counter. Um, you know, we'll do our takeout out of there. So if you're looking for a great way to warm up in the cold months ahead, Hen House Nashville okay. Hot Chicken has you covered with no plans of slowing down. Our goal is to open up a couple more stores around the Western New York area, and then eventually we would like to start uh, franchising out into other uh, areas in New York. It has been a steady stream of customers for my new friends here, Sal and Alex here, and the Hen House food truck. Again, the new location for Hen House. They hope to have it open up there on Hurdle Avenue by the beginning of the year. In the meantime, this food truck here, very busy tonight, operates at the what is it? Where, where are we right now? Here we go. Sorry about that. Briar Brothers Brewery. We're on Elk Street here in South Buffalo. Busy cranking out the food. We have all the information available at WKBW.com, but they're off and running here at Briar Brothers Brewery here tonight. And we're always looking for more stories, more opportunities to shine success and highlight really some of the great things that are going on across Western New York. You can share your Believe in Buffalo story by filling out the form on WKBW.com. We've been a lot of places, Leah, in our Believe in Buffalo series over the last several months. I don't think I've been inside a working food truck. And if you could bottle the air here tonight just to tell you how great this smells. Yeah, Boy, I was going to say, I bet it's make a just, lot of money like just saturating doing that. your clothing, yeah. too. You're smell like oh, french fries when you get home and the kids are going to get it's excited. And you better bring them something. All right, it's Jeff, incredible. Thank you so much. It's incredible. And thanks to our friends here. Yeah, have a good night.